Here we go. So yep, this is an old garden centre. A very old, derelict garden centre. It is a bit sketchy though, so we need to be quite cautious here. Because, yeah, houses in front. Is the old kitchen. Omron. Another Omron. Ah, what does this mean? T O 1 L E T. It must be two that. The old kettle's still intact after all this time. There's the old water source. Someone cut off up there, so that means the pikeys have sadly had a little rummage around there. Auto focus. Yep. Old telephone down there. Missing a bit of a roof. This is where the old plants used to be. Quite an echoey place here. And again, as it's quite out in the open, you need to be careful and limit whatever chances I've got. It's a flushing of water source for fun in here. Old Hoover. Oh, this is interesting. 1950s critter windows. Cool. Now, where is the toilet? Looks like a little trip around the back is what's needed. Dun dun dun. This is the old outside of it. All the buildings around the back. Found them. What do we have in the toilet? Two 90s overflows, but a more interesting run all around the back. Ladies. That's the crew under that side. This is interesting. Oh wow, nice. Blue seat. Old wash basin. Old heater. Hot water thing. And inside we've got just the average old day smoking here, really. Blue sock detected. Let's sell that product. No flush here, but to be honest, I'm not really too interested in flushing this one because water source is actually in the mountains. Right. Classic exploring adventures. Trying to get through doing some prickly things. If that doesn't work, try again a different one. And here we go, just got a little bit leave and leave and all like this. Right. 
in we go. Another Magnil, another Kenny, old bit of ceiling, and for a first, a urinal. And I'm not going to be able to flush that because the nuts off. Or is it Shanks? Towel survives, and the washbasin survives, and inside there is a black Cellmax seat. And actually, this is a uh, BS1234. Ah, it's a, it's a Rolling BO PQ by Henry J. Peters, Bitter K, Essex. Nice. Alright, let's give it a go. Nice was dripping when it was in use. But it, the float valve wouldn't be bent like that because a couple of thieves have been in and taken pipes. Yeah. Rare moment of me and not the system, so I'm not talking through that. I love it when they're this easy. Most of the time, yeah, it's really quite tricky. But this one's a gimme. Here we go, for a little system. Let's give it a go. Read the sign again. Short flush, press and let go. Full flush, press and hold. You can tell it's pretty eager to go then, so yeah. Outcome success. Now let's go.